Today we are gathered on a historical date, 11, 11, 11. 93 years ago today, the Great War, World War I, ended. Three years later, the Tomb of the Unknown was dedicated at Arlington National Cemetery to honor those missing and unidentified. This November 11th marks the 10th anniversary of Veterans Day in the post-September era. As nearly a century ago today, we honor the sacrifices of those who gave, as President Lincoln so nobly stated, their last full measure of devotion. In a moment, we will begin reading the names of 6,500 soldiers, sailors, Marines, and government agents who paid the ultimate sacrifice in the cities of Iraq and the mountains of Afghanistan. We are joined in this nationwide grassroots effort by thousands of students, faculty, staff, and community leaders at 173 colleges and universities nationwide, and the District of Columbia, who are conducting similar ceremonies right now. Today at 11 o'clock p.m. Pacific Standard Time, we will simultaneously join in the nationwide Minute of Silence. Our purpose is simple. We want those still serving to know that they have not been forgotten or their sacrifices of those who have fallen. The readings of the names will take nearly eight hours to complete as readers announce the names in chronological order. The National Roll Call is grateful to iCasualties.org for the steadfast recording of the fallen over the past 10 years from which the names of the fallen have been derived. Let us take a brief moment of silence before reading the names. Thank you. Sergeant Marco Miller, Lance Corporal Cody Watson, Corporal Dustin Libby, Corporal Jason Huffman, Sergeant Jesse Castro, Sergeant Joshua Madden. Major Megan McClung, Specialist Nicholas Gibbs, Private First Class Travis Creek, Captain Travis Patrickin, Specialist Vincent Pomity, Specialist Yari Mokri. Sergeant Yevgenty Rindich, Lance Corporal Brent Beeler, Staff Sergeant Henry Link, Staff Sergeant Christopher Criasso 